it's Ciara, and this is my second video in my Nail Neon Summer series. Wait, yeah, Neon, Neon Nails for Summer video series. Okay, close enough. I had so much fun making this video, and I hope you guys have fun watching it. I'm gonna show you guys how to recreate this super crazy, fun, neon, tribal nail look in this video. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and if you recreate any of the video, any of the videos, if you recreate any of the nail looks I've shown you in this video, send them to me on my Twitter, my Instagram, or my Facebook. All of my social media accounts will be linked in the description box below. So, let's get started. For this first look, I'm going to use the colors Neon Yellow, Hot Pink, Bright Turquoise, and two different shades of purple. You're also going to need some tape, a nail art brush, and a dotting tool. To start, you're going to paint your nails white and let them dry completely. Then you're going to place tape diagonally on each nail. Then you're going to take your neon nail polish and paint the uncovered part of each nail. Once the yellow polish has dried, gently remove the tape. polish and your dotting tool, you're going to trace the diagonal between the yellow and white polish on each nail. Then taking your turquoise polish and your dotting tool again, you're going to dot along the diagonal of the yellow line on each nail. take your two shades of purple and your nail art brush and you're going to make long lines on the white side of each nail. I decided to use my darker colored purple but you can use whichever shade you want or whichever color you want. This is the last step I swear you're going to take your nail art brush and your other shade of purple and go in between the darker lines painting shorter lines on each nail. Just seal this with your top coat and you're all set. These super fun nails are ready to go. For the second look, you're going to paint your nails all white again and let them dry completely. You're also going to need to grab a neon green polish, a neon blue polish, and a dotting tool. First, you're going to grab your neon blue polish and your dotting tool and you're going to make a line of five dots on the pinky nail. You're going to continue on to your ring finger and make a line of five dots, followed by a line of four dots. On your middle finger, you're going to make a line of five, four, and three. On your index finger, you're going to make five, four, three, two. And finally, when you get to your thumb, you're going to make a line of five, four, three, two, and one. I sound like I'm counting down to a race, but I promise I'm just painting my nails. Finally, grab your green polish and your dotting tool again, and you're going to fill in the dots starting with your ring finger. So it'll be one, then one, two, one, two, three, and finally, when you get to your thumb, one, two, three, four on the last row. When you're done, let everything dry completely before applying your top coat so the dots won't run, and you're all set. For the last look in this series, you're going to want to paint your nails white again and let them dry completely. You're also going to want to grab two glitter color polishes. I'm using a purple glitter and a gold glitter, a neon purple polish, a hot pink polish, and a black nail polish. For tools, you're going to want to grab your favorite nail art brush. Pour some of your colors onto a paper plate, grab your nail art brush, and start one color at a time making lines from the base of your nail towards the top of the nail. It doesn't matter if they're crooked or straight, short or long, just kind of do them a little crazily so they look kind of like brush strokes. Keep this step on each nail and try to find which balance of colors you like the best. There's no real rules to this design except to just make it look fun and summery. This is my favorite nail design to wear out and I got so many compliments of people saying it was so fun and summery and cute and I really like it. You don't need to let it dry completely before you apply your top coat. I think it looks a little cooler and artsier when the colors kind of blend together. So just apply your top coat and this nail look is all ready to go. 